Meghan Markle here. Okay, you mean Camilla Tomney Lai and Delica Mandela Nelson Mandela's granddaughter twisted her words to smear Harry and Meghan's, who surprised the face of jealousy, old cow. Okay, what is that? That's a retweet of that. Quote, I was contacted recently by an Australian newspaper to comment on live to lead. All right, so let's continue. Uh, I forgot where I left off. I got a phone call. So let's see here. You mean Camilla Tomney Lai and Delica Mandela Nelson Mandela's granddaughter twisted her words to smear Harry and Meghan. Who surprised? The face of jealousy? Old oh, cow. Okay. Let's see here. I was contacted recently by an Australian newspaper to comment on Live to Lead. Call me naive, but I did not uh, suspect that I was being recruited to oppress vendetta against the royal couple. I was shocked when my remarks were misused. Okay, I'll go into that in a few. Let's read some of the comments here. Okay, I know pathological liar who has an unhinged obsession toward Harry and Meghan. She is the same hack who reported the lie Kate made Meghan cry. Camilla Tomney a liar. Camilla Tomney a liar. Typical British media. Okay, waking up each day to hate is well different. Can imagine with all the beautiful ways in which we can shine light and spread love. All right, so let's see here. So they call her, they ask her a question, and then they misuse her words. They twisted her words. I don't know. When speaking to the British media, it's like you better be careful. Okay, that's the one I read already. In fact, I felt dumbfounded and disheartening to see my name and my grandfather's used to serve backlash against Meghan Markle, a woman of color who had the temerity to marry into the British royal family. Okay, that's uh, another article that's archived. It upsets me whenever the Mandela name or likeness is used for purely commercial purposes to sell merch without any benefit to the family or the charitable causes he championed. And I will always criticize such cynical profiteering. That's not what I associate with Harry and Meghan. Correcting the lies instead of letting them sit for so long that the truth become the lie and the lie is presumed the truth. More people need to speak up. There are so many lies circulating around the world against those two. It won't end up until the public stop uh, buying the lies. Yeah, that is, this is why I keep on doing this. And I realize many of you, and um, this is why I appreciate your support. Many of you don't have the time to go to Twitter and read all of the, all of these things. So I have the time. So I'm more than happy to share them with you and along with my humble opinion. But it's the lie I really hate to see you guys consume to think it is the truth. Because uh, it's the same sentiment that I got when I saw the Johnny Depp situation was happening. I mean, it was, I never met Johnny Depp. I never follow him. But you saw the thing was playing out. I'm like, oh my God, why are they doing that to this guy who never have a damn thing? Said, well, yes, there's some stuff about him um, that said before, but you never hear much negativity on the, um, on the tabloid. But all of a sudden, this woman is smearing his name like that. So it caught my attention to share my part. So once he won his case, and then I was following along to see what else is happening. But when his friends trying to take charge as if they've been there forever, they the number one supporter and whatever, I'm like, okay, I'm back off. I wasn't there for that to see if I'm going to be number one fan of Johnny Depp or whatever. So I back off. He won his case. That's all matters to me because the, the true victim won. 
okay so it's the same thing that caught my attention with megan and harry i never follow megan but i was happy for her to be married into the royal family and the perception that the royal family made me believe it's not what it is so i have to stand up for the victim okay translation kamala tamni is a liar okay kamala tamni how do you sleep at night aren't you tired of lying you know she is a baggage for god i mean at some point uh things will cut up with her all right so let's go to the next tweet oh where was i okay let me go back i want to make sure you me okay now i got it next one that said and these are adults okay next tweet this was my favorite prediction the royal watches held on to their delusional till the very end Spa <laughs> spared by prince harry let's see here prince harry to miss out on lucrative christmas market after demanding memoir changes <laughs> maybe that's the part the 400 pages that he removed because he didn't want to destroy the royal family and become bestseller that's him laughing that was the first time i come across this picture this is <laughs> this funny okay there's the laugh there's this oh Okay, Prince Harry's memoir, brutally snub and poor as majority said, they won't buy the copy. <laughs> Meanwhile, it breaks so many records. Okay, let's go to the next tweet. Ah, oh, come on. I have a first spot already. The phone, I had to pick up the phone. All right, next tweet. <laughs> Look at him. Mm -mm -mm. Lord, please, this can be little bit Diana and a time travel to the past. That's Harry. Yeah, sort of wow yeah lily doesn't really look too much like harry you know the hair and everything but um archie was more in my humble opinion look more like harry than lily does okay harry little bit megan yeah huh. maybe some past gene from back past generation decided to pop up now <laughs> Okay, little bed is a carbon copy of Diana. Uh, do I see that? I still don't see that on um, on little bed. Little bed's face is a little bit diff structured differently. I don't see that. That's a diff. I don't know. I, I don't think I'm seeing. I'm seeing the same thing. But you could see when you look at Archie's baby picture, you could easily see a little bit of Megan and Harry on Archie but little Beth is slightly different I know they say she has blue eyes and everything that's Harry's and everything but her facial structure slightly different slightly different unlike Archie was to uh, Harry okay little Beth same head shape and hair growth okay no it isn't Lily the smoking on the romper suit gives it away the fact that it's baby Harry Harry a little bit. All right. So this we knew this was Harry. Yeah, that's Harry. But I think the caption sort of make a reference that you know it looks like a um, little bit or something. Yeah, that's um, Harry. All right. Let's go to the next one. I'll edit this later on at 2 a.m. instead of recording again because uh, my husband's gonna come back and he's gonna work tomorrow. We have to go somewhere. Okay. Remember when they said skull and bone were so popular in america that their visit will be a a bit of media 2.0 that's all i have to say about this sussex squad spare okay daddy express camilla racket passed megan and u.s popularity poll after nasty attack on queen cancer <laughs> there is absolutely no way there is absolutely no way this is laughable they're making people blame if Camilla buys it, well, she got a rude awakening if she decided to come in, in America. All right? She's not going to get the adoration she thinks she's going to expect. Okay, It's too funny that they have their readers believing this crap. Okay, joke of the day, no one in the U.S. and their right mind think this way. Diana was and still is love here, very much so. We don't like Camilla, the cohort. I think they confuse her with Biden's mother. <laughs> it's Orwell's 1984 in the UK. The press create the reality of the proletariat. The headlines are propaganda aimed at locals. It's clear the function of the UK media is less like press and a functioning democracy and more akin to North Korea. Mm -hmm. 
oh my god <laughs> look like there's that um haha which nursing home did they take the the poll from okay if you mean william and kate wasn't aware that they were even in the u.s i read about it online after they left i don't remember any major news outlet carrying the story that's when they came to um boston to do the earth shot all right next tweet is the same thing but someone else bring a different uh, caption okay white supremacy is hell of a drug and you have to be full of it to believe it to believe this okay camilla that's the same thing again let's read some of the comments see what other squaddies are saying america is diana's country that's for sure that third person is not welcome here what does that mean what it means is that well there were three of us in this marriage so it was a bit crowded okay the people behind these polls are the same sort of people who said there was going to be a red wave in the 2022 midterm election believe me they tried to make it they set up for it they worked so hard to make it happen it's just that there were too many people who went and vote this is why voting is important too many people went to vote they couldn't really you know hide the amount of ballots i'm just throwing my thing here my humble opinion here but too many people went and vote look all the chaos that's going on they're still talking about it they're trying to oh, please let's do the same thing in the next election in two years for biden okay it's propaganda straight from the grebel's play playbook tell a lie over and over again until you drown out the truth okay exactly that's exactly that okay i'm thinking they might have taken that poll at a kkk nursing home <laughs> right okay who even believed the crappy express vibe hey some people do you never know if they sway one mind believe me they succeed J just that one person who knows how many other people he's gonna ruin uh their mind to okay the media regulator really need to make fake and erroneous administered poll are often subject to a huge fine these fake polls influence everything from voting to consumer buying trends and professional reputations. Yep. Okay. And this is why Harry don't go to IPSO anymore. He goes straight to the to the court because the IPSO are the same group of people. All right. They just avoid the facts. They avoid seeing reality. They just align themselves with their bodies. Okay, I don't believe their polls. Of course. Okay, I immediately realized it was absolutely rubbish. The actual results are here rather than the skewing interpretation of the statistic by the Daily Daily Express. Uh, right? Today, YouGov.com. I'm not even going to click on it. Okay, someone is evidently high on a lot of cocaine. Nobody and their mama believe this lie. The royal voter must think we are crazy in the USA. Uh, why they really believe this nonsense american will never like the queen concert we remember diana and we are loyal if nothing else that's for sure all right this is my last tweet all uh, right and then uh, at 2 a.m i'll edit it right now it's 7 28 p.m and my husband is about to come all right harry you raggedy b <laughs> this is funny harry you raggedy b uh, why didn't you tell us what you were whispering in her ear at that moment and spare? Huh? <laughs> That's the cry. And this is me who responded to that. Oh, four people like it. I'm, I'm surprised. Okay? That was like an hour ago. Maybe he didn't say anything to her because his tongue was in Megan's ear demonstrating the magic of his tongue that can do some other things. Who knows? These two always in their bubbles. I like it for them. Who knows? Okay, let's see this. I want Harry to say it. Okay, this is someone that I mute. Who's that? Girl, we all know what he was talking about already. <laughs> that she's saying here. <laughs> I want Harry to say it. Okay. Well, considering this was after the London meetup, when we got the line at the end of the chapter, quote, I want to say we hung the do not disturb sign on the door, but there was no time. Then started the next chapter with, in the morning, we need a <laughs> sustenance. We can only imagine. Okay. I want to hear the detail. <laughs> <laughs> Vanessa is crazy. She really want Harry to say it. <laughs> I want to hear the detail on his own word. Hello, <laughs> well, that's in French. Okay, I think he said, "Baby, my toddler is isolating." <laughs> that's that. Uh, 
<laughs> okay, that's part of the additional 400 pages that got scrapped. <laughs> I automatically thought of this when I saw your tweet. Okay, no, you didn't. But it would have been nice to know. The last night before he had to head back to London, you know what he was whispering. And she went all the way and, oh my God, you guys are freaking crazy. <laughs> Vanessa. Oh, boo girl, we all know, we all know that ginger lordy. Okay, we, we, you know what came to mind as I'm saying this? I think when she was in London and uh, he went to her room and the uh, what is it what was it someone came to bring breakfast or something like that and he had to st he wanted to go hide but megan was telling go hide in the bathroom but he stays in the bed under the sheet and while the person was who was a fan of soot was talking to megan and he was under the sheet <laughs> he couldn't breathe <laughs> so you know this is the thing that came to mind just now as i was uh reading some of the comments here so yeah but anyway let he spend the night hey he gotta get his vice before she head back <laughs> okay let's see here there's a lot of people who like some stuff here i know why right? it's always the same exact meltdown i'm like why are they shocked okay uh maybe he didn't say anything that's the thing i was just reading okay who knows like tina michelle said okay i talk about this already maybe he didn't say anything there's the thing again there's that these are the things people are liking all right so let's do a prayer and then i'll get back to this at 2 a.m prayer for for the word goodwill hunting <laughs> the movie just came to mind let's see what pops up prayer for harry let's put harry for Harry and Megan Goodwill Hunting. Let's see. Goodwill Hunting. Let's see what comes out. I know the picture of the movie might come. Okay, it's called for the couple to be blessed by God and ask that quote they may both live and grow in your love all their days. And quote hey, Harry and the American former actress. Okay, so people do send their prayers for them random prayers i don't know some crazy words be usually come to mind when i'm asking for the prayers okay something came up oh lord the source of all true love we pray for harry and megan grant to them joy uh, grant to them joy of heart seriousness of mind and reverence of spirit that as they prepare to be joined in marriage they may be strengthened and guided by you through jesus christ our lord amen this prayer looks like uh someone sent that prayer before uh, their wedding yep it loaded november 27 2017 okay that's the date behind it never mind all right so that's it please take a moment to subscribe like and share if you want to support this channel there's a paypal link and a cash app link in the description you could donate those who have donated thank you and stop by my other channel which is my main channel PYTE and subscribe because at some point I'm gonna go back to that channel to do my regular um, tweets okay and uh, once again thank you for your support great privilege to be with all of you today. You know, we want we ask for forgiveness and uh, and please come back.
Thank <laughs> you.